President Obama made an unscheduled stop in Baghdad today. What would you like to see the president accomplish while he's there? I think I'd like to see him repair some of the damage that the Bush administration did. Assure them that the United States will continue to support them regardless. Just to bring the troop home so as soon everything is safe, is safe over there. Maybe he can give the troops some, some morale booster. Uh, we've been there a long time. It's time for us to go home, but the work job is not done yet. Was President Obama's trip overseas a success? Yes, it was. He got a lot of recognition, which he needed overseas, yes. The stimulus package approved by other countries, Germany and France, that part of it wasn't a success because they can't, they don't have a license to print euros. Like we have a license to print dollars. He's replicating what he did on the campaign trail all across Europe. I mean, it's pretty striking. Whether or not anything was achieved meaningfully about world peace and so forth, telling people to disarm is something that all of us will favor, but words don't change reality. Do you think the president should be reaching out to Muslim countries? And if so, how should he do it? I think he has begun to do that. And I think what he did in Turkey is a, a way to do it and continue the conversation about, uh, uh, about this. there's no war against you know, Arabs or Muslims or, 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 or the religion. I don't know whether we have any partners in peace at all in, in that type of uh, uh, scheme of things. So uh, he, can, he can try what he wants to try. I don't think much is going to happen. These small gestures that he made, laying a wreath, pointing out his own heritage um, is very important. It's got to be with a touch of reality as well because they're not doing their share in combating uh, extremism by any stretch of the imagination.